This is Nick, he's 24. This is Nick, he's 22. I was diagnosed with Ewing sarcoma. It's a type of bone cancer that usually attaches itself to the leg. I was diagnosed with ALL leukemia. Hi, I'm Jasmine. I was diagnosed with Wilms tumor when I was four years old. My name is Eric Foster. I was diagnosed at uh, the age of nine with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. My sister, Laura, was diagnosed with uh, osteogenic sarcoma and um, she was able to go to camp the next summer, summer of 91, um, and my other siblings and I went the next week to camp fest. How do you do? They really say, I, I love you. I, I had to give back because Camp Good Days did so much for our family. And honestly, I don't know what life would be like if we didn't have camp. My sister's illness became our life, and Camp Good Days was a place for all of us. We were so young, and it was a place for all of us to go um, just to meet other people and kind of get away from everything. Um, and it made my sister so happy, and she only was there for five days. She passed away a couple months after she went to camp. It made her such a, so happy. Um, and we knew, you know, by us continuing to go that we kept her spirit alive. You know, people say, um, wow, you do a lot of volunteer work, but I don't see it as volunteer work. You know, it's, it's just fun for me and to go and spend all this time with all these kids and just great experiences. I like the dark and I think to myself. Pretty in the sky are also on the faces of people passing by. I see friends shaking and singing. How do you do? Really Camp is a wonderland because of all the wonderful things that all the, the staff and volunteers do for all the children. It brings them to this wonderful place where they can run and play and go swimming and do whatever it is that they want to do without the... Uh... Without the worry of all the doctors and everything that they have to deal with at the hospital. They can just be a kid. Camp Good Days, it, you know, it didn't really change the way of my life. It's kind of, it is a way of life because, you know, they're, they're going through some tough times that I've already been through. So I can kind of, you know, explain to them that, hey, I've been through what you're going through. And when they see, when you... I can see the reactions in their face that when I say I had cancer and they're just like, wow, you know, there's this just normal person that had cancer, like maybe I could, you know, it'll give them that hope and, you know, courage that they can have to go through these tough times. The colors of the rainbow, so pretty in the sky, are so unfacing. Of people passing by, I see friends shaking and singing. How do you do? And thank you to all of you for keeping the Wonderland alive for so many. Camp is a Wonderland. It is a place that's so unique and so special, 
and um, to us, it's been a part of our lives for 16 plus years, and we're just one example of the kind of families that you're helping, so thank you for your support. Thank you for listening to our memories. Because of you, we have them. What a wonderful Job there. There's no running allowed at Camp Good Days. Uh, there's no bare feet either. No bare feet. <laughs> and no, no e in the ool. Don't forget that a clean camp is a, is happy, a happy camp. camp. <laughs>